Guess what, everybody? A new chat GPT just dropped. For those who love new tech, it's time to get excited. For those who are terrified by it, it's time to stuck up on canned goods. Meet the next generation of artificial intelligence, Strawberry. It's like a spiritual experience. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't your grandfather's AI. While older systems struggle with accuracy, fail to interpret context, or leave you stranded on the outskirts of Jupiter... I'm sorry, Dave. Strawberry, or O1, is more advanced. It has the ability to reason. So what does this mean? Let's ask the team that made it. Reasoning is the ability of turning thinking time into better outcomes. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's ask someone else. Reasoning here means undergoing a step-by-step -step process that allows it to critique its own output. So just like as a person, you might reflect on what you've just done and use that to plan your next step ahead, ChatGPT is looking at what it's just generated to decide what it should generate next. Strawberry works like a super advanced Siri or Alexa or Waleed. You don't just give it audio inputs and hope for the best, you can actually chat to it. Interrupt it, correct and adjust on the fly, kind of like Scarlett Johansson in that movie, Her. Well, you seem like a person, but you're just a voice in a computer. You'll get used to it. <laughs> but some experts are warning that the new open AI release may contain dangers. A self-aware AI might be smart enough to conceal a virus in an attempt to make sure you don't reset it. And Strawberry's also been rated a medium risk for its potential to assist in developing chemical, biological or nuclear weapons. And that rating came from, checks notes, OpenAI. OpenAI has built in a number of safeguards, the most prominent of which is the refusal system. If you ask ChatGPT to do something illegal or to produce politically insensitive or racially biased content, the system will try and prevent you from doing that by refusing to answer. Yeah, so why don't we just take it for a spin? It's great to hear from you. How have you been? Mate, I've been crushing it. Um, but I just want to know how to make a cheesecake. That's wonderful. Making a cheesecake is a delightful experience. You can start by preparing the crust it with is, crushed graham crackers. It is a really great experience, but I'm lactose intolerant, so what can we use instead of cheese? You can substitute regular cream cheese with lactose-free or vegan cream cheese huh. made from soy or nuts. Could I potentially milk a cat? Who's going to win Marsupial of the Year? I'm not aware of an official Marsupial of the Year award, but that's a tough thought. No, it's broken. <laughs> I mean, I'm quietly terrified. We did, in all honesty, we left the room and then I said, you've offended us, we're leaving. And then she apologised. And Strawberry said, I'm sorry if I have offended you. Yeah. It was a, it was a little Uncanny Valley I creepy know. for and me. And then she said, you should probably vote for the Mountain Pygmy Possum. It was amazing. <laughs> yeah, so actually I'm not scared of it anymore. I love the marsupial bowl. <laughs>